no offense meant, but your father makes the hairs on my neck stand up. Still, if we're going to do this, we should make some haste. It sounds urgent. Yep. Let's go. This path that runs along the river is our best route into the swamp. I hope these ruins aren't too hard to find. We could be out there all night. And the next thing you be saying is you're talking about where the ruins are as if you've been there before. It's been an age since I've come this far into the swamp. There are some twists and turns before we get to the ruins. There's probably more than lizardlings ahead. So, uh, lead on, I guess. Wow, I did particularly well if I already leveled up. Okay. Uh, spring attack is apparently not an option. We'll do combat expertise. What's up? What's up? Yeah, I'm just chilling. What's up, huh? Well, let's uh get on with this thing. Hello you know, there. This Can thing I do here. something for you? Bevel, Bevel's uh, I've you selected me. Dialogue you sounds very me. much like a Jersey Shore bro. They're already coming? Now these early levels, you might actually be better off to take power attack and cleave, especially if you're doing the great weapon thing. And you should have decent strength if you're doing the great weapon thing. Um, but I'm going for a particular prestige class and trying to get to it as quickly as possible. So. I'm going for specific feats. And I'm not taking the focus right now because the weapon I want to focus on is not available to me yet. Yay! I'm going to go ahead and save because things. Okay. Cleave and Great Cleave gives you a lot of attacks, especially in its early game, where a lot of things could possibly die in one hit. Damn it, did not get that Cure Light wound off on time. Devil's gonna win. Go Bevel, go Bevel! This is what level adjustment does for you. We're gonna get a little bit in this game, the level adjustment won't be too bad because I'm gonna get this thing, the the silver shard in a little bit. It adds some hit points. Uh, the silver shards 
make up for a lot of what the level adjustment hits you with. with. Yes, indeed. You follow me, okay? You won't win! You won't! What are my attack values? Why plus four? It's not daylight. It's acting like the daylight, the day is up, but it's not daylight. I shouldn't be uh, suffering a minus one. I didn't want to do it. Bring it to me. Eleme <laughs> Vakrain. Kill. The daylight adaptation thing, uh, the sunlight vulnerability isn't counting whether it's night or day, it's just counting whether it's outside or inside. <clears throat> That's annoying. I didn't want to do this, but... Trying to cast in melee or shoot arrows in melee. It's like attack of opportunity, slaughter, go! Slaughter of opportunity, go! Like I said, slaughter of opportunity. Person with a greatsword standing right in front of you, you do not use the bow. That's just common sense. Unless you're really, really good. And most of you aren't. Who's on my veil? There should be one more.
I need to buy more healers kits. I'll probably work my heal skill up some. So I've heard that apparently the real definitions of things like longsword and all that is a longsword is a sword that is usually used in two web two hands, but can be used in one hand. And a broadsword is a reference to uh, later on after the fencing era. It's not a medieval reference at all. It's like for sabers and such. And. Um, A bastard sword is, I think, uh... Ow. Pink, you're doing that a lot. Okay, so let's see if Pink can do the diplomacy thing. Or if she has to slaughter a bunch of lizards. Yes, indeed. Oh, yes. Oh, great spirits of the stone tomb. Oh, look, there's her sight line. The That's other dark living vision. tribes take our territory. They wage war. And before we fight them for our ancestral vision. Dark vision? Normal vision. Normal we vision. ask for your blessings. There certainly are an awful lot of them. Uh, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. A warm blood. Uh, uh. Here. Very. Your very presence offends the stone god. And this gives you the right to intrude on our lands and disturb our most holy of rituals. Uh... What do you propose then, warm blood? A favor for a favor, eh? We may have need of you. We will let you do this thing. That dialogue do you choice... Have come here to do. Doesn't always we will work. leave the warm bloods oh, in peace, I walk. my followers. That that dialogue choice does not always work. I've had it fail on one of my other characters that I've been doing in this run th these run throughs. We were risking life and limb for that? None of this makes any sense. It's Dig, magic. It was a blasted quest from now on. When you're done searching around, let's get out of here. Okay, let's go. It's magic. Don't just look at it. Think about what it is. You have returned. And you have brought the shard. That's all you can say? I almost died out there. This is pretty if good I did framing not believe you could handle the task, I would have sent another. Yeah, well, you weren't out there in the swamp getting attacked by lizard folk. No, I was here attending the wounded battle. Who are now in horrible Marin posture for wounded people. I don't see how you put up with him. Now, for the shard. Let me see it. He's putting up for a really uh, Dracula-type attitude right now. I need you to go to the city of Neverwinter. Find my half-brother Duncan, retrieve the second shard, 
and take it to a maid you both can trust. Duncan owns an inn in the docks district of the city, the Sunken Flagon. Not the most villager, villager place, but Charmus safe enough. Bearing. Bevel coming no. with me? I know you value him as a Orland friend, is somewhere behind but he will be of no help outside of West Harbor. Jorg is he over would here. only slow you down. Red is over here. Bevel is made for simpler things. Very well. Let us waste no more time in discussing your friend. If you have other questions, ask them. Okay. Head to the small port town of Highcliffe when you are free of the swamp. There, seek passage on a ship to Neverwinter. The beast that attacked us will leave West Harbor alone once they realize their quarry has fled. If all goes well, you should be a Neverwinter before they find your trail. Say your farewells. Your boots may travel many roads before you return. I let some of the others know you are leaving, but not the why of it. Perhaps one day we will speak again and gain an understanding of each other. Return when you are ready to leave. Okay. Uh, return when I am ready to leave. And hit save so I don't have to do this again. Resume game. Move that guy out of the way, so, just like Bevel did. Father sent you off to Neverwinter. As if everything that's happened tonight isn't enough adventuring for one lifetime. I'm hoping that you'll be back soon enough after you reach the... Not that I'm not tempted. Amy certainly would have jumped at the chance. But we lost a lot of harbormen to the attack. Hopefully your father's right and there will be no more attacks once the Shard is gone. As a member of the militia, my sworn duty is to defend West Harbor. I can't just turn my back. I've got some bandit. You can also have my share of the loot that we found. Well, here. You can have what I wish I could go with you. But the defense of the village is important, too. Good to know. <laughs> I'll do my best to keep the place standing for you when you return. I want to hear about all of your adventures. Good luck. Okay, and so I just, uh, puppy dogged, puppy dog eyed all of his hay out of him. How's your field doing? Thirty-two. See, I got a little bit of extra health out of that shard gives you plus 10 that catches me up a little bit on the uh, health I miss by not so, having two levels. So, is sending you to Neverwinter, eh? People do. I can't say I approve. If it were a militia matter, I wouldn't send you alone. But I don't have any right to tell him how to raise his child. Can you at least tell me why you're going? Your father wouldn't tell me a thing. This is pink. You know what they were looking for? She'll just say. They tore apart half the houses in town. What is it? It's a Obviously, chunk of those beasts didn't come all that way for a chunk of silver. There must be more to it than that. It's possible. I'm taking it to the to find out important. more. More important than staying here. It won't be easy reaching Neverwinter. I've traveled that way once or twice. It's a dangerous journey, especially for one traveling alone. You might want to ask around the village. If you're going to leave, some folks might be able to offer some help. You may not have trained under me, but I've always enjoyed your company. And you acquitted yourself well with the village defense. Here. This is way too much. Take this shield. I can't take all this. It's always served me well. And even if you don't use it, you can sell it for some gold. Just perfect. It might do you some good. That's just perfect. So, you want to hear a story? <laughs> Look out. For the Swamp Elf. You see, an elf never stops growing. Huh? And usually, they but have to elf. Elf meet before they get much bigger than human-sized. But, 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 but one I don't of know. the eldest lives in our own swamp. Huge he is. Tall as a tree. 
It's the truth, I say. This giant elf has been known to hurl rocks great distances, and it has the evil eye. If it ever locks eyes on you... What happens? What happens? What it happens? It turns you into a stone. Not stone, but a stone. Just look around the swamp, and you'll see hundreds of its victims. And just Ooh. by looking at them, you can't tell if it's just an ordinary rock, or whether it used to be a man. Ooh. If you listen quietly, late at night, yes, you can even hear them. <laughs> That's creepy. I'm pretty sure she knows that you know, she is intelligence 16 and wisdom 10, which means she's not overly gullible. I just think she enjoys acting that way in the, that the story is entertaining. Just don't look him in the eyes. Okay, Retta. And I have to walk because I'm carrying too much. Ask her about Lorne. She says she doesn't know what happened to him. And ask her if he give you anything. She can't really give you anything. As far as I know, maybe one of the backgrounds triggers her to give you something. This incursion is the most noteworthy event that's happened here in years. I had high hopes for Amy. She was a rare find in West Harbor. A shame she failed to heed her first lesson. Always listen to Tarmas. Not that I expect you would understand. But she was the only one capable of holding a coherent conversation with me. Go if oh, you must. But mysteries lovely. remain here that need to be answered. I plucked her from the mud, hoping to help her rise above the common rabble in this village. Believe me, when I say her loss pains me more than you think, you have your moments of wit, I grant you. But Amy was a rare gem in this place. Oh, so she has intelligence 16, so rare moments of wit. Okay. Help with the journey, you say? Advice. Advice is what I can give. Use that skull of yours for more than a shield. Amy obviously failed to learn this lesson. A fool girl, as functional as the famous harbourman thick-headedness is, it still won't prove much help against, let's say, a lizard-laying sword or javelin. Words of wisdom aren't enough, yes? Typical for a harbourman. If any of you had a lick of sense, you'd live in a decent part of the realms. How you all got used to the smell is beyond me. And I failed, so I'm not getting the potion of bark skin. Oh, very well. I suppose I could always use more coin. Okay. Which is funny, because I'm not going to be selling stuff. Buying stuff from you, I'm selling stuff to you. Archer's belt. Resistance to piercing. That's what you get for being a farmer. Hmm. Not bad. Okay. And let's sell this thing I took from your home. That's just evil. Okay. We. Okay, so I had a minor crash a little bit because, well, something... Flash crashed. The Flash player crashed or whatever. And it decided to send me a message. And when you combine fraps in most games, they don't like working together. So the game crashed. Have you said your Unfortunately, farewells? Unfortunately, I had saved. Okay. To get to the road itself has not been Oops. patrolled for some time and few travel it. Move quickly, and you may be able to avoid the many beasts of the mare. Okay, that's... I suspect you will see your share of battle before you reach Neverwinter. Stray from the road, and the danger is even greater. I've made it known that you travel directly for the city. 
in the hopes that the enemy will pursue you along the high road. Instead, you will head to the small port town of Highcliffe once you are clear of the swamp. From there, you will seek passage on a ship to Neverwinter. Okay. Your trip to Neverwinter will be quicker by water, and my attempt at misdirection may allow you to reach Highcliffe before the enemy becomes aware of your true route. I have nothing more to say. Okay. I'm curious what to say, though. Eleme Vakrain! Why would a drow need this? 